Hello, CSGO recently had winners for the Dreams and Nightmares contest uh, that they held, and it's going to be in a case very soon, and I'm very hyped for it, and they already announced the winners. And believe it or not, there are already some people, like this dude down here, hold on, let me find it, let me scroll through all the weird reviews and memes and shit like that, because there already is a guy I saw that says that the case... Is bad. There, there was already a dude saying that all the skins are bad, so don't get it. No, that is not true, at least from me. And I mean, it's just an opinion, but I think that there are some really good ones in here. So, first one is Next Gens. This is really cool. For Red, even, this is, like, amazing. Uh, it's pearlescent, and I really wanted more pearlescent skins in the games. And the games, I really wanted a pearlescent skin in the game. And I mean, there already were some, but they're they were very minor pearlescent like effects. But this one is a like basically an entirely pearlescent gun, and that's really cool. I'm glad that they added that one into the game. Next one is this one. I'm pretty sure this is a red as well. And it's a weird choice. It's honestly very weird. I didn't expect them to pick a unicorn one. I mean, I get it. Yeah, I know it's a dream one, but I didn't. I still didn't expect them to pick a unicorn one, although maybe there weren't that many good ones for the red MP9. But I saw some pretty good ones, actually. So I don't know. I don't know why they picked that one over all the other ones. But hey, it's a good skin. It still is a good skin. Uh, then, then there is the pink MP7. Which is really good. I really like this one. Again, I like kind of glitchy and pearlescent effects. I like pearlescent the most, but I also like chromatic aberration or whatever that's called. Like where the like the lines are like glitched and there's red, green, and blue. I love that effect. And this is a great skin for that. And it's a pink and it looks really good. It's not like super detailed. It's very simple, but it's it, it's it, the colors carry it. The colors are really good. Um. All right. Next skin is I'm pretty sure another pink, I think so, um, and it's this one, this is a odd choice, <laughs> it looks very weird, I think it's supposed to be a watermelon, maybe, I know, it, it, yeah, it, it looks like a watermelon, but maybe it's not, but it looks, it looks very creepy, but I like that, I like that it looks kind of creepy, because that's the whole point, it's supposed to be kind of creepy, because it's a nightmare skin, uh, next one, is this from this FAMAS is insane? Look at this. I love I love like kind of eye, like eye designs where like the gun is like has like eyes all over. Um, it depends on how the eye looks on the gun, but this one looks really good. This one looks really really good. It, it kind of looks 3D, even though it's kind of not. It looks amazing. This one looks really good. Um, I'll try to get most of these skins when they come out. Not most of them, but I'll try to get the ones that I think are my favorite. When they come out, if they're not too expensive, hopefully they aren't. This looks like a blue skin, although I'm not sure. This might be a pink, or not a pink. This might be a purple, but I think it looks like a blue skin. It might be a blue skin, or it might be a pink, uh, purple skin. But this one looks alright. Uh, if it's a blue skin, then it looks pretty decent for a blue skin. I like the, it's kind of cute in the middle, and then kind of like very kind of sinister in the out. And like the green, like they're like hiding in the trees. That that's pretty cool. Uh, next one is uh, hopefully I'm clicking on the right ones. There we go. This one looks pretty cool, and I'm pretty sure this is a pink or not a pink. I <laughs> Stop saying pink. I'm pretty sure this is a purple, and it's a pretty good purple. I mean, look at this. That's a pretty good purple. It's pretty detailed. The eyes are look look pretty good, even though they're kind of hollow. Uh, the paws on the barrel of the gun looks really good. Uh, and this, just this entire skin and like the swirly little bits of the cat looks pretty good as well. Uh, I know I'm kind of giving all of them like the good treatment and like, you know, the awful treatment. This one is my one of my favorite skins. I love how simple it is. Look at that. I'm glad that they added this one. I'm so glad they added this one. Because holy shit. And I'm pretty sure this QR code will probably lead to something like a secret or something. And th this is a really cool skin. It's really simple, and it's really good. I'm guessing this one's going to be decently expensive when it comes out, and it'll probably like drop in price, obviously. But I'm when it, once it comes out, I'm pretty sure this is going to be a decently expensive skin because of how kind of detailed each of the little details are. You know, like the little the text on here, the tiny little text, the QR code, the teeth. Everything looks really good on that gun. I'm glad that they added that one, especially. <clears throat> 
Next one is this. This is a pretty, it, it, I think it's kind of symbol, sim, sim, symbol, I'm pretty sure this is kind of similar to the off-world uh, Glock and the P90. You guys might know what I'm talking about. It's kind of like those, but it's colored and it has a little bit more detail. And I really like this one. It also is pretty good. The eye is pretty cool. The skull looks all right. Uh, there's like weird text there, you know, it, it's a pretty good skin, although I don't think it's a really great nightmare skin uh, I think all these fit the nightmare and like the dreams stuff very well But that is the first one I'm gonna say doesn't really fit the nightmare that well I mean, it's just like kind of graffiti. It looks good, but again, it looks good, but I don't think it fits it very well uh, But you know, I'm still glad it got added to the game because it looks pretty cool uh, and then this one that one looks pretty decent, but again, it doesn't really fit the nightmare theme. I don't think that much that one I, I guess like the eyes fit it well, but just because it has eyes doesn't mean it's automatically fitting the nightmare theme I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a nightmare. I'm pretty sure this is like a happy dream or something It might be a dream skin, but I still don't think it fits very well with a dream or a nightmare scenario of skins But again, it looks good. It's simple and it's good, but I just don't think it fits very well in the case this one actually kind of fits I mean the ghostly little figures going uh, like rising up from the trees the little hash the little hash marks there this one fits the nightmare theme very well and I'm pretty sure this is like a blue and that's a pretty decent blue as well uh, next one is this this one it will give me give me a better picture there we go uh, this one is pretty all right another chicken I don't know why there's so many chicken I don't know why there's so many chickens in this case a lot of roosters and chickens but all right yeah the, the, like there's those different patterns it's, that's really cool I, I really like how it changes it really changes like the different pattern probably will change with like the different patterns uh, there'll be like more roosters and more chickens on certain patterns and it'll be like more artsy on some of the other ones that's pretty cool and it kind of does fit the nightmare theme very well the like the dark trees the kind of blue slash purple background the creepy looking chickens that one actually kind of fits with the uh, nightmare theme i think pretty decently uh next one is this <clears throat> this one fits really well this one fits extremely well with the nightmare theme the glowing eyes the weird little like the weird little uh fang not fangs what am i <laughs> fangs claws or like hang, or like creepy little skinny little hands coming from these goblin looking things or alien looking creatures that one looks really good and i'm pretty sure this is like a, a this is probably going to be a purple i think that one's a purple maybe it's a blue if it's a blue it's way too good for a blue i'm pretty sure it's, it's going to be a purple though <clears throat> and this sawed off really fits the uh I, I think it pretty decently fits the nightmare theme as well a ouija board classic horror thing a kind of a horror trope at this point and it looks pretty good. There's like the battle scar. Once it gets more battle scar, it becomes darker. And, uh, you know, that's cool. And uh, it does kind of fit with the nightmare theme as well. Because, you know, once you like the Ouija board stuff comes out, it, it, it seems like it's stuff from your nightmares and stuff like that. I think it's pretty cool. Although, uh, it's, it's probably not one I'll use because I already have a sawed off skin that's like really cheap and it looks all right. But, you know, it's a pretty cool skin. And I'm pretty sure that's going to be a blue. I think that's definitely going to be a blue. So yeah, those are the skins. Those are pretty good. I'm pretty sure some of them could have been replaced with better skins. But hey, I'm glad with the um, other the new skins I got that are going to get added. I, I honestly am very glad. Especially with the, uh, what do you call it? Hold on. The uh, USB. I need to find it. Oh, this one. I didn't even cover this one. What am I? <laughs> I'm not even thinking, dude. I, com I think I completely skipped over another one as well. This one's pretty cool, cool as well. Look, look at this. Is a creepy looking woman with like kind of like red marks on her face with a bunch of uh, like insomnia and shit and fear agony this one looks pretty good it's a edgy skin but that's the point it, like this one's pretty cool it's like a kind of factory styled one i really like that i really like that i completely forgot to review that one i'm sorry and i think i might have skipped over another one hold on let me see no maybe i didn't but that's really it. If I skipped over one, I'm sorry. But I'm trying to find the... Uh... Oh, wait. Yeah, this one. This is the one I skipped over. There we go. This one... 
pretty okay. I, I was gonna say it looks pretty bad, but now that I look at it, it fits it pretty well. It honestly fits it pretty well, and it's like a cartoony, little nightmarish, little cute thing for like this people who be, people who like this art style will love this one probably. I personally, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm all right with it. I don't, I'm not. It's kind of cute, but that's the point. Looks pretty good. Uh, I think it was the one before. I think the USP was the one before that. No, it wasn't. I can't find it, man. I completely forgot what the name was of the person who made it. Hold on. Uh, <clears throat> I clicked on that one like three times already. I'm retarded. This one, right? No. It's above. It has to be above. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think it's a long. Is it Des? Not Des. Fuck. Where is it? Where is it? Oh wait, that was one I didn't cover as well. Hold on, back, back to it. This one, this one, also looks pretty good. Octopus lose win. It's like a kind of yin and yang one. It's it's a mixture of dreams and nightmares, and I really like it. it it's it, that one's pretty good. And it's a blue skin. It's dull in colors, but it it makes up with the details. Like it's a blue. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a blue skin. But uh, it does a lot of detail, even if the color is not that great. And it won't pop in game, and it'll be kind of hard to see. But it still is a pretty good skin. Um, let me find... I'm, tr I'm still trying to find it. Okay, I'm pretty sure it was on the top half. I thought it was, like, like on the bottom. Uh, but uh, I think it was, like, in the middle. Somewhere, maybe. Hopefully I find it. <laughs> Come on. Come on! There we go. It was Supreme Matt. Jesus, it was the one in the middle. And I just It was the one that I didn't click. Yeah, this one is my favorite. Probably in the entire case. Like, look at this thing. It's so simple, yet it's so good. Like, look at that. I'm definitely going to be using that as a USP skin. I'll probably sell some stuff to uh, get it. Or I'll probably just add some money to my Steam wallet to uh, get this skin. Once it comes out, I'm not going to get it immediately because it's going to be expensive, but once it drops in price, I'll probably get it because this is a really good skin. And I'm pretty sure this is probably going to be a pink or a purple. It's definitely not going to be a blue. It's way too detailed for a blue. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of it, and I'll see you guys later. Sorry, I'm not wearing my glasses right now. I'm just, I don't, I don't need to wear them. I'll wear them when I go into a game, all right, man?